Hello everybody, this is Ali Reza. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Kian.Smart Home. In this video, I'll integrate a Toya touch switch with Home Assistant. The integration is very simple. You should add Toya integration, then enter your Toya credentials. That's it. But there is a question. How Toya devices work in Home Assistant? Are they fully, let's say, compatible? Watch the video till the end to get the answer. Before that, please click the subscribe button, which is a motivation for me. And like the video if you find it informative. Thank you. This is a 4 gang Toyo touch switch. I have added this device to Toyo application. Using the Toya application, you can turn each relay individually on or off. If I change the state of each relay using the touch switch, we have the feedback immediately in Toya. Let's do the integration. In Home Assistant sidebar, I click on configuration, then integrations. I select add integration. In the new window, I search Toya. Select Toya. A new window pops up. In this window, we have to enter our Toya credentials. Username, password, country code. The app where your account is registered. At the beginning of the video, I mentioned Toya. After entering Toya credentials, I click on Submit. Home Assistant finds the four switches. In this page, you can set an area for each of the relays. After that, by clicking on Finish, the integration is completed. In the Integrations page, Toya is added to the page. By clicking on configure, a new window pops up. In this page, which is Toya options, we have a time. This time is related to discovery device pulling interval in seconds. By default, it is 605. You can decrease it or increase it. But do not set pulling interval values too low. I set it to two minutes then I click on submit options successfully saved click on finish by clicking on three dots menu of the Toya integration we have rename system options documentation reload disable and delete I select system options in the new window we have Enable newly added entities. It means if newly discovered devices for Toya should be automatically added. So if you add Toya devices to your account, they should be added automatically in Home Assistant. Enable polling for updates. Both of them are enabled. I click on for devices. We have lamp switch switch 3 switch 4 as they are named in Toya app. I select switch. Using Home Assistant, we can turn the switch off or on. I go to overview page, select three dots, edit dashboard, add card. Then select entities. I remove pre-selected devices from the drop-down list of entity. I select the four switches of Toya device. Switch, lamp, switch three, and switch four. I set a name for them, Toya switch, switches. Click on save. So using Home Assistant after integrating Toya devices to Home Assistant or let's say with Home Assistant, we can turn them on 
or off. But what if I change the state of each relay from the touch switch? All of them are off, I turn them on. The only issue in Home Assistant is that if the state of relays are changed from touch switch, their feedback is shown with a lot of delays in Home Assistant. Let's wait to see how long does it take to show the feedbacks of the real status of the relays. Okay, this is the only issue. I search on the net to find out the solution to tackle it and the only solution I found was flashing the switch to local Toya. I go to configuration page integrations in Toya integration I click on for devices in Toya application I change the name of switch 3 to halogens by giving time to home assistant after a while it pulls the data from the Toya and it shows that the switch Three name is changed to halogens but it needs time by going to integrations page selecting menu of Toya clicking on reload it is done fast the integration was reloaded okay I go to devices switch switch 3 is changed to halogens this is it i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have any question do not hesitate to leave comments bye, -bye.